welcome back to my channel hope you guys are doing well checking out my channel for the very first time welcome if you're returning welcome back and guys thank you so much for your support if you're brand new welcome to the Nacho Yolette family I'm Yolette welcome to my channel all right so today I wanted to do a video on how I put on makeup if I'm running out and I don't want to look like I'm wearing makeup. I like wearing makeup in the summer, but sometimes I, I feel like, you know, it's too much. But, so I decided I'm going to try some of my new products that I have and also go ahead and show you guys how to do a real soft makeup look so people can't tell if you're wearing makeup yeah I have a few new products I'm going to use so well <laughs> when I say new they've already been out there I just got my hand on them so it's something really easy nothing major you don't want to seem like you're overly done if you're just running an errand but you don't really want to look black okay so I'm gonna go ahead and start using my Fenty Pro Filler so the first thing I'm going to try is, is the Fenty Bright Fix Eye Brightener in the color Almond Butter. As you can see, I have not even opened it. And yeah, so, so basically what you do, you take a little bit, oops, took more than a little bit, and you add it. Oh man, this is way too bright. We are going to just take this is way too bright. Cover it up with another concealer. Oh, I didn't know it's like that. I think that's how you do it. And then what I'm gonna do is, I'm taking my old concealer that I have, and it's called Born This Way Naturally Radiant Concealer in the color, I don't see the color, but I'll put the color. And this is one of my concealer that I use all the time. It's an old concealer. I'll I was able to go online and find the concealer because normally when something doesn't sell, I notice it's not available unless you go to like I think TJ Maxx or other places. So put a little bit over the the brightener. This is, I think the color is a bit too bright for me. I'm using this for my little imperfections. And I'm just going to blend it in. This is the reason I'm using the brightener is because I have not used it. And I figure, you know what, let me try it. And maybe I'll like it. But uh, I think this is one of her products that I'm not too keen on. Maybe if I got the right color. And sometimes what I do is I only use the, the Born This Way concealer and I just conceal my little spots and then call it a day. Yeah. Um, the brightener, I don't know. What do you guys think? Okay, so I think adding this over top of this kind of helped a little bit, but yeah. When she dropped her tint foundation, it's called Blurred Skin Tint Foundation, the Ease Drop. That foundation went whoop, and it was sold out for months and months and months. And I think I was like, let me go online and see if I can find it. And I was lucky to find it. So I do have her tint, her other tint foundation that she has. And then I also have Laura Mosier tint. And I use that, that's all I use. So I'm gonna try hers. This is the first time I'm trying it out. And I'm gonna put a little bit on my hand just to test it out. Okay, here it is. So I'm going to take my beauty blender. And this is an actual first impression. Not open it. I got it maybe about a 
couple of weeks, two weeks ago, and I was like, you know what? Let's try it. Let's see. And so let's do just really light makeup. Let's start blending. I like it. Let me add a little bit more. Cover it up again. Oh wow, it's okay. It's this was worth the wait. This was definitely worth the wait. I love tint foundation because it's not heavy. It looks like you're not wearing anything. It is nice. All right. You guys see that? So I add a little bit of the eye brightener. And over top, I added my, this is Born This Way concealer. This is an old concealer. And then I add the ease drop. Then I just started blending. And you can see my skin. You can still see my little blemishes. You can still see my little spot. I just want to add a little bit more so I can cover my little shadow. See if I can cover my shadow and then do my nose. Okay, what do you guys think? We like, we like it. We like, it was worth the wait. The eye brightener, I think I, the color that I have is a bit too light for my skin tone. Okay, so, so what I'm gonna do right now is set it. I'm gonna use my Laura Mosier dab a little bit and just put it around here because you don't want to look like you're wearing makeup just just enhance your your beautiful skin that's all you want to do just enhance that's all you're doing you're just enhancing okay let me do my brows. I'm going to use my Ulta. It's my Ulta Slim Brow Pencil in the color Dark Brown. And I do just the minimalist when I do my brows. Really, really minimalist. And I like this pencil because the tip is very thin and you just Follow the shape of your brows and then cover the sparse area. I love this pencil. So we're doing the same thing with this one. I take my Anastasia Beverly Hill Tint Brow Gel and just go over. See that? And call it a day. All right, how's that? I have your your golden from ColourPop. This is the first time I've purchased the eye palette from ColourPop, and I'm like, ooh, we're gonna try it today. Oh, and it's got some beautiful colors. You see that? So we're gonna do something very light, nothing heavy. So I'm taking. This color here, and oh, this is too dark. I'm taking lounger right here, and then just, just add it. You see that? Very light. Ooh. That's it. I'm moving it all the way up till my brow, near my brow bone. Ta da you see that? And I'm only using maybe two colors. It's pretty. 
And so which is the next one I want to use? I don't want to use too many colors. Look like I'm wearing makeup. If you bring it all the way up to the brow bone, especially you can see it's like closer to my skin tone. And then I'm going to take Follow Me, which is this color right here. Just a little bit. And then just add it to... Oh, that's way too much. But we're going to blend it in. And then just add it right here. But that's too bright. We're going to tone it down. We're going to tone it's, it's It's more pigmented than I thought. Oh, it's very pigmented. So I'm going to tone it down. I'm going to take lounger. And then I'm going to go over it to tone it down. Alright. Okay, since we're not supposed to look like we're wearing makeup, so we're not going to wear any falsies. Alright guys, I had to make some quick, quick movement, but hopefully you guys can see me better. Yeah. I had to switch, switch around, so... I'm just blending in the color. As you can see, it's so beautiful. It, be it matched my skin so so perfectly. And yeah, this is all you have to do. I really like this ColourPop palette. It's really the first time I'm using ColourPop. So yeah, I really, really like it. It has some really beautiful colors. Um, that I can play around with. So, some matte colors, some shimmery colors. It is perfect. All right, so, so the next thing, once you get your eyes all blended in, I'm using my Thrive Liquid Lash Extension. It adds length to your lashes. Look at that. Okay, this is one of the best mascara that I like so far. So the next thing we're gonna do, we're gonna do a bronzer. Use my Fenty Mocha Mini. Just a little bit, just add a little bit to bronze. Like where the sun would hit you. I love this bronzer. I'm not one to be hopping around and buying things until I finish using it. And I am going to be using this for a minute. Okay. I'm using my Fenty Pore Filler Powder to just set everything. Like it, like it, like it, like it, like it. For a little bit of highlight, just a little bit. And of course, I'm still using my MAC. Just taking a little bit and just, just add a little bit right here. Not even a lot, just, you see that? Just a little bit. on my nose and that's it that's all I need and then just add a little bit here do, 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 do. whatever it's left in my hand just add it and voila can you guys see that uh, uh, yeah the H Perfection Radiant Satin Blush by L'Oreal. It's a little bit. You can see that? Okay. So now 
cheeks. We're moving on to the lips. Guess what I got in the mail? Yes! I got my Nima Tang nude. Oh my gosh. Where's the others? Just so you guys think I'm making it up. My Nima Tang nude. I went on Dose of Colors and they had it and I ordered it and I went back to order another set for a family member. It was gone. It was sold out. So I'm using the Dose of Color liner in the color Chocolate Chip. Ooh. You ready? Are you ready? Oh, it's dark. It's beautiful. Oh. Mm-mm. It's so smooth. I just blot it. This is my Nima Tang and chocolate. And I take a little bit of Asian and just take it and just dab a little bit mm. and then I found this, this awesome color it's called Dangerous Curve from MAC I actually I, I went to where did I go I went to TJ Maxx and I was looking for something nude and I found this this it's something that you're not going to be able to find in a store. And I started using it. And look. Look at this. So I add this over. Neo Tang. Liner. And here we go. Mm, mm, mm. Ta -da! Okay, so now I'm going to set my face with, with my Urban Decay All Nighter. And that's if you're going out and you're going to be out and you don't want to sweat. Yeah. Ready? So here we are. Here is the finished product. Can you see? Can you see my glow? Can you see the glow? Can you see that? Can you see it? What do you think? Ooh, like it, like it, like it, like it. Guys, I mean, first impression, love it. I'm a little on the fence with this one, but you can see with my concealer adding it to over it, it turned out beautifully. What do you think? Guys, let me know what you think. Alright guys, thank you so much. I hope you enjoy my easy summer makeup, running to the store, running errands, or going out and you want to feel beautiful. You don't want to have all this cakey makeup on. This is it. All right, guys. Thank you so much. I hope you enjoy this look. Let me know what you think. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel. If you've made it this far, you might as well subscribe, right? And join the Naturally Alive family. It is a beautiful afternoon where I am. So good afternoon. Maybe morning where you are, 
good morning it may be evening where you are and good evening and guys have a beautiful talking about a beautiful and blessed afternoon evening morning and guys be blessed